Hi guys. So finally, finally I I got the right wall box uh, for the for for the house. Um, so it still it still says um, wall box uh, plus. So I guess it doesn't differentiate whether you're getting the 22 or the 7 kilowatt. It is still you know the plus is still there. I think. Um, one thing that noticeably different, I feel like the cable seems bigger. Maybe, I don't know, or maybe it's just my eyes, I don't know. But I thought this one was also different. I think it was white and neat, now it's black. So there are... So yeah, so... So there it is. So now... Let's see how this works. I'm actually uh, just arrived, got back from home, from work. The first thing that just decided to try is this 22 kilowatt. So, in essence, it would give me 11 kilowatt or 10 kilowatt ish um, um, because the car has 11. Um, kilowatt charging capacity hold on the wire is not that long enough I'm gonna sort of like me okay it's doing the handshake yep now it's charging okay so so the color is the same no change it's still blue yeah, I I think that the cable is is bigger than than the one that I had. So it looks. Don't worry, I'm gonna sort of like put it properly and just hang it back properly. Just gonna see how this one works. Let's go and take a look. What is the magic number? Ooh, yes, guys. Okay, so. Yes, <laughs> so almost eleven kilowatt. Yeah, now, 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 now I'm okay. So it seems that um, um, the car onboard charger can accept eleven kilowatt. So it's pretty good. Hmm, I don't think anything much you can get here, but as you can see, it's 10.9 there. So technically, so when, when I was using the 7 kilowatt, I think usually from almost, you know, 60%, um, 60% going to 80, I think it was around 2 hours and 15 minutes. So if you can have an 11 kilowatt, onboard charger then it shortened by you know by um, more than 45 minutes roughly so definitely it's faster more convenient I guess um, yeah so I'm happy I think this is um, um, definitely a, a good buy um, I mean at least it is um, meeting the onboard charging capacity for the Kona Max 64 kilowatt because the highest you can go is 11 so right now it's around 10.9 so it's all, it's there already i mean nothing to complain i'm pretty sure the the kilowatt will will drop when it reach um, a higher number but um there there it goes guys um a 22 kilowatt um charger now rightly installed now it is producing 11 kilowatt um, charging for the car thank you that's it